Good, live. Hey, what's up? Um, good gabi everyone. This is Mark Bertulfo from PH Dads. And uh, how's everyone doing? Hopefully you're all doing great even though medyo may pagka uh, you know, may pandemic. Of course, you all know that. And uh, naka, naka, nasa bahay tayo lahat ngayon. Pero uh, one good thing about na nasa bahay tayo lahat ngayon is that um, there are still ways para kumita. Right? And uh, th- and one of those ways is uh, working from home. So, uh, we are fortunate enough to be collaborating with one of the top, if if not the top, uh, uh, e-learning, teaching, English learning, hopefully, hindi ko siya ma-murder, uh, platform, hindi sa Pilipinas or uh, sa buong mundo, it's uh, they are 51 talk, they have like 20,000 uh, e-teachers right now and 200,000 students in China right now. So they are big. They, they've been doing this for, I know, they've been doing this since 2011, 2012. So they really know what they're doing. And um, they are actually, they, uh, they collaborated with Twitch Dads and FH Moms to... Uh, introduce ESL and uh, well recruit basically. So more on that later. Ngayon pa pakilala ko yung guest natin. Uh, she is uh, she she is a long time teacher. She's actually uh, I don't hopefully I don't murder, murder this again. Uh, teacher captain captain teacher something like that. Parang like I don't know. She she'll explain it a bit later. Uh, she's been doing ESL uh, for a long time, and uh, we have her right now. She's from Butuan City, and she's she's a uh, Ada Jules. Uh, is it Jules or Ules or is it Ju- Ada Jules or Jules or how do among Yes, hello. My name is Ada Jules. Jules. Yeah. Yeah. Great. <laughs> Great. And, and of course, um, good evening, evening Ada. And uh, we also have uh, a marketing and peer representative from 51 Talk, Miss Ingrid Pagulayan. Hi. Hi, uh, Ingrid. Hi. Hello. Good evening, oh. ma'am. <laughs> yes, good evening. How's everyone doing? Good sa mga Is the audio okay lang ba yung audio? Like, narating yun, narating yun naman, right? I'm happy. I'm safe. I hope everyone is safe too. Great, great. Okay, so so let's let's talk about um, um ESL. What? I can hear you through my phone. I cannot actually hear you through the website. Oh, okay. Um, pero naririnig mo right? so, so medyo may delay lang, I guess. Oh, may delay lang. Yeah, okay. So, I, I don't know. Pero, well, it looks great. Uh, you, you look great, yes. really. <laughs> yeah, so, um, let's start with, um, ano ba yung, ano ba yung ESL? Because, I, I, I mean, like, the term has been around for quite some time. When you talk about home base, online, uh, what is ESL ba? You can, can, can can you explain what is ESL? Sige, go Ada. Um, well, online ESL is... <laughs> Thank you, ma'am. Okay, online ESL is a modern way of teaching English as a second language because everything is done online. And the internet allows us to have virtual classrooms where we get to meet and teach our students interactively. Wow. Great. Um, like, uh, so, so, so you teach, how, how, does, how does that go? I mean, like, Paano kayo nakakuha ng students? Like, uh, is, is it assigned to you or someone picks you from a list or how does it, how does it work?
Um, that's what I like about 5-1 Talk because teachers are very flexible when it comes to opening their slots. So 5-1 um, Talk only requires to um, only requires teachers to open 55 slots. So that depends on us whenever we want to teach. And we will just open a slot and then a student will book that time slot. And there is a classroom, an online classroom called Air Class. That's where we teach and everything is prepared. All you have to do is teach and have fun with the student. <laughs> that sounds nice. How about how about the the lesson plan? I mean like planning lesson plan. I mean do you Madam Bang I guess? And uh, who who prepares that? Um, the students get to choose a lesson and then everything is already prepared. Uh, the lesson, um, the material is already there. All you have to do is enter the room and everything is prepared for you. Like um, 25 pages. And so maybe Mark, um, you're wondering yeah. also, tsaka yung iba rin na nanonood sa atin ngayon na maybe if I apply to 5-1 Talk, baka naman I'm required to come up with my own lessons, baka ang hirap naman. The nice thing about um, starting out as an ESL teacher sa 5-1 Talk is that, of course, um, you undergo training after a um, successful application, yung onboarding mo, di ba? So you undergo training and kasama dun sa training, of course, yung materials. So if we get to um, if we get to give you that opportunity as an ESL teacher, you don't have to worry because we have standard lessons um, from Five One Talk. Na itetrain namin kayo. Yeah. So all you have to do, of course, okay, okay. is aralin so, yon. Uh, mm. mm -hmm. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. So, all you have to so, so me, me, uh, me training siya. Pero um, I'm I'm guessing ang iniisip na ng karamihan na well of course sa grupo ko lagi na ano ng mga tatay sa um, paano yung requirement ng ano ng pagiging teacher I mean like para na hindi pa para na ka intimidate kasi like kasi ah uh, um, ang tanong lagi niya is what if hindi naman wala akong teaching background wala akong units ng teaching I'm from the BPO or something like that so so paano siya for this, you don't need to be intimidated naman. Um, uh, the, the basic requirements that we have for 5-1 Talk teachers, you have to be a graduate of a four-year, any four-year course, kahit ano pang ano yan, um, kahit ano pang um, discipline yan, basta you're a graduate of a four-year course, and then don't you don't have to worry about the training because, of course, bago ka i-launch as a 5-1 Talk teacher, um, we will make sure na mag-undergo ka ng training and you also have a demo class. Oh, okay. Um, so, uh, ladies, pwede nyo bang bigyan kami ng um, uh, example like yung mga teachers nyo, saan sila nanggaling, ano yung mga courses na, na pinanggalingan nila? Like, uh, you, you mentioned, hindi mo kailangan ng teaching units, right? So, yung mga teachers nyo, roughly, Saan sila galing? Ano yung mga course na natapos nila? If you don't mind. Yung mga teachers nyo, saan sila galing? Ano yung mga course na natapos nila? Sorry, Mark, again, medyo may delay tayo. I'm not just singing. Kasi ang tanong dyan, ang tatanong ng mga tatay, ang tatay kasi medyo mapanigurado. Even before they apply, actually, marami na yung tanong. Hindi sila pa sa mag-a-apply. So, Ang isa tanong is, um, ano yung mga, mga courses na pinanggalingan ng mga teachers nyo? Just, just so that yung mga nakikinig sa atin, mga nanonood sa atin, is uh, makarelate sila na, oh, baka doon ako galing, or galing sa ganito doon, baka pwede ako dyan. Yan, sige, Ada, can take this. Sorry, I can hear you now. <laughs> can you please repeat the question, sir? Can you hear me now? Oh, wait lang, wait lang. Okay. Mas okay na ba? Or ganun pa rin? Yes, I can hear you now. Thank you. Ah, okay. So yun na yun. Okay, so yeah. So may mess up ako. Yeah, I was saying, para makarelate yung mga nanonood sa atin, especially mga tatay, can you cite some examples of yung courses or yung mga 
te, uh, educational background na pinanggalingan ng mga teachers para well, para ma ano lang maka relate sila no kung baka galing si ganito diyan hindi sila ma-intimidate Mm, okay. So, um most of the teachers are um different yung mga pinagraduate and um I am a, I am a graduate of business administration. Um however, even though I am a graduate of BA in the education, um it's it's very easy to teach in 51 talk kasi um yung lessons or yung materials are already there and aside from that we also have teaching guides so that helps us on for example some activities that we don't know yet so there are guides or scripts we can read to the students great how, how about you students on students bus like um can you describe ada uh yung usual na students like ilang taon ba siya or or nagbabago-bago ba yan Yes, it always changes. Sometimes uh, my student is level zero and then the next student will be like um, a teenager or a 12-year-old kid. So nagbabago talaga siya. You really know how to blend in with the grade language of the student. So if um, the student is pre-level learner or yung mga level zero, nagsistart pa lang sa English world. So you can speak very slowly and you just have to give more rewards kasi it's encouraging for their part also to give token of appreciation sa effort nila for um, for engaging in the activity. And you learn that through training, right? I mean, like, nasa yes. training, right? You paano yung psyche, yung, psycholo- yung psychological side of stuff, right? You're yes. trained to do that, right? Okay, great. great. <laughs> okay, so, um, um, English, why do you think ESL is a popular uh, livelihood choice right now. So, marami, I mean, like, I, I know for a fact, actually, si Jim, my brother, mm-hmm. he worked at 51 Talk. Is it 51 Talk or 51 Talk? 51 Talk siya. 51 Talk. <laughs> Sorry. Yes. Uh, Kasi sa Chinese, it murder. sounds like, ano, I want to talk. Yeah. Ah, okay, okay. Kasi ako minimurder yung pangalan. <laughs> 51 Talk. Sorry. We forgive so, 51 you. 51 Talk. <laughs> Thank you. So, I know Jim, for a fact, Sabi niya sa akin, he used to work uh, at Five One Talk before mm-hmm. long, long time ago. So, so I know na pick na popular yung ESL na work. But why do you think Ingrid? Bakit siya nagclick dito sa Pilipinas? Kung uh, yeah. Kasi um, si, um, siguro it is known naman na sa Asia tayo mga Filipinos then very high yung ating ano yung um, competency level natin when we speak English, kung hindi man siya yung, hindi mo nasabi lahat perfect, pero maraming nakakaintindi, kahit di ba, they use um, certain words, parang napagkakabit-kabit, it's understandable. And for, um, ano, that's why they also prefer um, hiring English teachers from the Philippines because of our neutral accent. Tsaka yung ano natin, dahil we're Asians, Diba? Parang mas nakaka-relate tayo sa kultura nila. Ayun. And siguro ESL as an industry, um, because na of our ability to speak and express ourselves in English, um, nakita na it's really a viable, um, um, it's really a viable career na pwede mong pagkakitaan. Pero diba before, pagka mag-aaral ka ng English, punta ka pa ng school, but because of our yeah. advancement in technology, um, it's just made it available na pwede na natin siyang gawin face-to-face without having to see each other, di ba? I mean, see each other physically. Awesome. Yeah, actually, um, yeah, I actually, I, I, it, it actually makes sense uh, now, now that I think of it. Nga. I mean, like, um, as, as Filipinos, may, wala tayong accent talaga. <laughs> may accent, so, mas, I guess, mas clear siya pag tinuro kasi wala kang yung intonation and stuff is sakto lang, hindi mo, wala siyang English accent, British accent, or kung ano man. Mm-hmm. So, with regards to that, Ingrid, can you, can you uh, explain more, ano yung 5-1 talk talaga? Kasi parang minorder ko na naman yung introduction ko pa. Can you, <laughs> can you, we are, siguro well, you can explain better that, uh, please, please, yeah. 
So Five One Talk is an online um, e-education platform. Ang ano namin is uh, online ESL, so teaching English as a second language. So dun talaga na concentrate yung aming um, CEO, yung or owner. They really saw this opportunity um, back in 2011, 2012, and then of course it's been. Um, it's been a few years, may mga trial and error, ganyan. Siyempre, of course, um, it was a new frontier then, pero because of, ano then, um, I would like to say that they are risk takers and they really are passionate about education. They're passionate about teaching people, uh, teaching um, Chinese how to speak to the world, how to express themselves in English para mawala rin siguro yung barrier, para mas maintindihan sila. So they decided to start this company. Kasi ang mga bata din sa China, as early as, ano, para mga toddlers, um, gusto na ng mga magulang yan, natututo na ng English. No, yeah, para maging, yeah. I guess, globally competitive then, right? Yes. Kasi, I mean, like, uh, if if you're from China, I mean, most of, most like, kasi, I mean, I, I, I went to Singapore, and of course, in China, pero uh, when I was there, parang everyone was shipping there, really shipping, pero pinag-aaral yung, yung mga bata sa ibang bansa para mas maging, I don't know, aware and, and competitive and stuff, right? Kasi, uh, well, I guess yun yung labanan eh. Uh, like, lalo na ngayon, everyone needs to, needs to, needs, needs to know how to speak a language that everyone understands, right? So, Uh-oh. so actually very good call. And actually, hindi pa po sa questions, pero, um, I guess maraming magkatangang ito mamaya eh. Um, <laughs> how, how do you become an online ESL uh, teacher at 51, uh, 51 Talk, sorry. How do you become, yeah. Yes, um, personally, I was referred by my friend. She was teacher Bernith, and I'm so grateful to her. If it wasn't because of her, I wouldn't be here with you right now. And uh, Five One Talk has also helped her very much because she was suffering from lupus. And um, while she, she needs, yeah, she needed rest, and she wasn't able to go to college. And so she, um, by that time, 2015, um, she uh she she was earning she was earning while uh, resting kasi nga may sakit siya and yes um sadly she's already she has joined the creator last um last year it was her first year anniversary last march 1 and i'm very grateful to her and if also if you want to be a teacher you can click the link below in the comment section and someone from 51 talk will contact you and it's just fast maybe a one to two days lang yung hiring process Oh, awesome. So, sobrang straightforward lang, guys. May link dyan somewhere, I guess, may link sa, sa comment section. Uh, we put it there. Um, so, yun nga, sabi nga ni, ni Ada, just click it, click the link and straightforward siya, makapag-apply na kayo. Okay. Um, technical requirements, ladies. Paano naman yung technical, re- technical requirements sa job? Because this is live stream, right? I mean, like video to. So, uh, ano yung kailangan na uh, hardware and uh, net net speed or ano, ano yung mga kailangan para makapagturo sa five one to? Well, um, I have a YouTube channel and I actually um, talked about this one right there. And just to be detailed, all you need to do is a laptop or a desktop with um, the fifth generation Intel Core i3 or any AMD equivalent with um, a memory of 4 gig and 60 gig free hard disk space. And also, we need um, a headset with extended microphone, a webcam, and um, a well-lit environment, uh, something that is quiet and clutter-free. So, okay, ulitin ko. Ulitin ko from the top of my mind. 4 gig na RAM, at least 60 mm-hmm. gig na hard disk space, memory. Uh, yung headset ba, does it need to be like noise cancelling or... Kasi yung kitong headset mo, eh. Ano <laughs> yung headset? Like, ano, ano ba siya? Like, kailangan ba mamahaling headset or... Anong, ano yung pwede na? Um, you need, oh, you really, you really need to have a noise cancelling headset with extended mic. And also pala, just to add, we need an internet connection with, um, 
wired. Wired internet connection kasi that's more stable than having a class. Hmm. Uh, in terms of um, MBPS, may, any requirement? At least three. Uh, three. Okay, so hindi naman siya ganun kataas actually. Mm. So, sa wired, okay guys, so you need uh, again at least four gig na RAM, which is sobrang basic lang nun. Uh, you need 60 gig na uh, free uh, HDD or SSD. Uh, yung nga, medyo kailangan ng magandang headset, right? Kasi you'll be teaching. And anything na pag may mata na tricycle, syempre dapat din naririnig yung concept it sa kabila sa China, right? Or, diba? Kasi uh, nangyari sa akin yan dati. Anyway, uh, and um, how about yung webcam? Do you need like um, medyo uh, high-end na webcam? Or what are you using right now, ba, Ada? Um, pwede 720 or 1080p. I'm using um, the a for tech 1080p. Um, I only got this for 700 pesos, I guess. Uh, I'm not sure. But yeah, it's less than 1,000. So very cheap lang siya. And I really like the quality. <laughs> how, about, how about yung light? How about yung light? Are you like, do you have like para miring light ka ba or something? Or ilaw lang yun sa, kasi ano eh, uh, well-lit ka eh, diba? So, ano yan, may meron ka special na ilaw or something? Yes, I have my light here in front of me and my ring light also. If I turn off my light, it looks like this. So, wow. this one's better. <laughs> Great. So, actually, so guys, again, uh, hindi ganun katas yung requirement na para makapag-guru pa if ever. Sobrang basic, pati yung internet speed, actually, mas mababa siya sa usual na hinihingi sa, sa mga online jobs, right? Mm -hmm. um, kailangan nyo lang at least, of course, mas matasis, mas maganda, right? Pero, 3 Mbps na wired, medyo papasa na, right? That's, that's right, right? So, okay. yun, um, in terms of experience, uh, Ada, ilang taong ka na sa, sa, dito sa 5-1 talk? Um, I started teaching since 2015. However, I need I needed to prioritize my thesis, so I stopped for a while. So that's um, maybe 2017. And right after I graduated last 2018, I reapplied again. Because I was really planning to make this a full-time job, and I didn't regret naman any of those decisions because I'm so happy. <laughs> great. So, tagal, tagal na rin pala. Ingrid, uh, by the way... Yeah. Um, ano yung plano, ano yung plano ng 51 Talk for, for this year? I mean, you collaborated, you're trying, you're collaborating actually with several communities right now. As I mentioned, uh, you already have 20,000 teachers and you mentioned before that you're, you, you want to expand or something like that. Can you, can you expound mm -hmm. on that? Um, ang, 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 ang target talaga namin by, um, in the next, uh, three to five years is to really um, get a hundred thousand Filipino teachers wow. to give them that opportunity because nga andun yung ano eh, andun talaga yung demand and dami talaga rin students na um, nagahanap ng ano yun nga they sign up for the classes talagang gusto nilang matuto and then um, di ba na mention namin kanina na yun ang mga bata pero actually si Ada she's ano um, nag-usap rin kami she's actually had that experience had that experience na nakapagturo din siya ng some professionals there are some professionals who sa adults they sign up then sa platform para sa ano, um, English um, English learning. Mm. Oh yes, that was a yun. CEO because he wow. wanted to expand his business. Maybe in that was New York, if I can still remember. Yeah, New York. He wanted to expand his business in New York, so um, he had an interview or he had uh, he will have a meeting that time. So he was calling me or he was having a class with me as to how to answer the interviews or the probable questions that will be asked um, as he was expanding his business. So, um, iba iba talaga. Meron kids yeah. from from two years old up to sixty years old or more, maybe. Yeah, from from very basic to interview questions, right? So. So, sobrang laki ng range, right? Nung, uh, nung tuto. So, it, it's pretty interesting kasi, um, I mean, like, every every day, every lesson, like, almost iba-iba. Iba-iba yung ka -ka kaharap mo, right? Or, or paano ba if, if like, may tinuruan ka na isa ngayon, uh, siya pa rin ba yung tuturuan mo bukas? Or, 
nangyayari ba yung ganun or how does that work? Um, if the, it, it depends if they will book you again. That's why you really need to give your best. Your, ah, okay. um, you show your best skills para i-book ka ulit. And for uh, for me personally, um, they always book again and fully book talaga for God's grace. Fully book siya lahat until the end of the cutoff. Kasi nga, parang they always um, have this typical time slot. Like they have 2 o'clock from February 1 to February 15th. That's their time slot, 2 o'clock. So I get used to them already. They're already part of my daily routine. And um, mm-hmm. happily for me, I'm also part of their daily routine. Maybe um, um, some of my students have been with me since I reapplied again, 2018. One year, more than one year now. Oh, so parang like, hindi uh, ko siya mas madali pag ano, like kasi may retention yung may continuous improvement, right? Kasi oh, hindi mo na kailangan pakisamahan ulit. Alam mo na yung mm-hmm. ticks, right? So, oh. nangyari din pala. Tsaka natututupan uh, niya yung studyante, di ba? Yeah. So, so I may mean, nagtanong, before, before I could, I may mean, nagtanong lang, and it's pretty, ano rin eh, interesting. So, sabi niya, hanapin ko lang, can I take this? Like, siya makilip pala. Sabi ni Junjo, uh, Sir, ma'am, what are the, what are the odds for an old guy like me? I am late 40s na. So, paano nga pa niya? Kasi, how, Meron ba age limit? I mean, let, let's I mean like let's lay it out na rin ba. I mean, is there is there an age limit uh pagiging ESL? As far as I know, um as long as you meet the requirements in a college graduate and you know, if you're trainable tapos yan, you are willing to learn. I don't think that should stop somebody like him from trying out and applying. Kasi I'm sure, diba, with his experience then, kahit ano pa yung background niya, you know, to si Sir mm. Junjo ba to? Tama? Yeah, yeah. Tama. Ayun. Yeah. Uh, you know, matter what your background is. Meron pa nga si Sidney rin eh. Hindi tanong niya. Um, yeah, go I ahead. Think, sorry, go ahead, Ingrid. Oh, I think there's always something that you can bring to the table and, you know, just try it out. Diba? You never know. Diba? Take that first step. Yeah, so, actually, yeah, magandang, magandang point yun. Um, sabi nga ni Ingrid, uh, wala, right? That's, that's basically it. Walang age limit as long as you, uh, you, you hit the, I mean, meron kang, kompleto ka nung requirements and stuff. And you, And like, kumasa sa, ano, of course, sa interview, yeah. And, and you like to teach, basically. I mean, you, you can, you can't work as, a, as a teacher if you don't like teaching. <laughs> so that's, that's one thing, right? Oh yeah, kasi sabi ni Jeannie, uh, need talaga college graduate. I guess so. Right, uh, you new requirement. So four years, any any four mm-hmm. years course, right? Any four year course. Uh-oh. Um, Ada, can you describe? Yeah, well, yeah. Uh, can you describe any typical work day mo? Um, I'm not really a morning person, and that's what I really love about Five One Talk because they don't require you to wake up early. There's no prep work. You don't need to make your own lesson. You don't need to commute, especially even before COVID-19 situation happened. Um, I'm not a morning person. I always wake up at nine o'clock, and uh, my classes <laughs> start at nine thirty. <laughs> <Okay>. Yes. <laughs> yeah. So typical, because in the office, you need to um, arrive at the office before eight. So you need to wake up early, take a bath, and that's what I hate most, <laughs> taking a bath very early. So yeah, that's what I really love about 5-1 Talk because I get to uh, I get to really do whatever I want and without any pressure. Because I wake up at 9 and then I start my classes at 9.30. I only plot four consecutive classes and then I take my 30-minute break. And then that goes on for the rest of the day. Two hours and then 30 minutes, two hours left, 30 minutes. So it's not really tiring. Very, very chill lang siya na work. Isang lesson is um, you teach for like half hour or one hour? 25 minutes. Like isang lesson. Mm. So like, uh, ilang ilang minuto ba siya? Twenty five minutes, and you will have another five. Sorry? Twenty five minutes, and you ah, will have another five minute break for another lesson. 
it depends on you very flexible kasi yung work namin and um if you wanna if you wanna open a slot now you can you can open a schedule and then you will wait for a student to book you so and then that's just it you go online you you can teach english in your pajamas like literally <laughs> all you have to do is wear a shirt um a formal shirt and then that's good to go <laughs> um in terms of okay so how does the platform work um do you have to optimize your profile kasi pa- paano siya hindi paano ba yung ano paano yung paano siya how does it work kasi like of course for example like the player right and i went through i went through the, the training goods na ako i'm ready to, to work um and sabi niyo kanina yung student yung siya yung magbo-book right siya yung magbo-book mm-hmm. right it's not, the, it's not the platform booking you for a student so it's the student booking you uh from the uh, in the platform so meron bang like uh, is there like uh, optimization of profile or something that, that i need to do para mas marami akong booking or uh, how does that work ba especially Ayan, kung bago ako yeah. right Oo. Si Ada makakasagot yan kasi si Ada, she gives, uh, she coaches din dun sa club niya. So, yan. Sige, go, Ada. <laughs> well, um, of course, you need to give your best sa students mo and just so you will, because Five One Talk is a growing company, so you also have to grow with Five One Talk. So, um, when I say growing, that means you also have to be better every day. You give, um, you give, you give your better version every day, and of course, you have to always be updated with the trainings. Because like that's also very important. Everything is visible on our students' end. They see the, they, they see our profile, our trainings, the feedback. So that's also very important. Um, why you need to do very good or do something unique every day, so they will they will book you again. Because like they will also leave reviews like this teacher is awesome. She's so much fun. Mm-hmm. So that's also an inviting message for other for other students to also try your lesson and if they like it they're gonna book you again hey, is it is it illegal to ask for a review is, um, is, uh, <laughs> yes, I'm, just, uh, I'm just thinking out loud okay um yes we don't really actually ask for them to hey can you um give me a good feedback um it's it's not illegal but it's very unprofessional to do so so if they really okay. like you they will give it to you um wholeheartedly <laughs> okay yeah yeah okay so tinanong ko lang kasi that's that's um one of my work i i, I do amazon ranking so i asked that kasi bawal sa amazon yun eh so So I asked yeah. that. Yeah. Okay, great. Uh, okay, ito, 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 most likely maraming nag-iisip nito and I guess nung mga sa mga nanonood ito rin iisip. How much time do you need, uh, how much time uh, do you spend teaching and and roughly can you give us like a ballpark figure of how much you can earn? Kasi yeah, yun, yun, yun yung susunod na tanong din magkani kitaan. Ay, alam mo na Pinoy, di ba? Magkano ba, magkano, magkano ba yan? So, Right? I mean, just let, ano natin yun, discuss na rin natin yun. Just, if you can say yung actual na figure, just ballpark na lang, I guess, right? Mm, okay, so, so, so uh, yung time and then yung, ano, yung kita. Um, five and Talk only requires teachers to open at least 55 peak slots. So our peak hours are from 7 p.m. to 10 p.m. So it depends on the teacher if you're if the teacher wants to earn more so she can open more slots and um I spend at least 10 hours uh teaching in 51 talk and also if I do that for the rest of the whole cut off um I set my own personal quota kasi I must not um I must not have um something lower than 20,000 So um, that's what I earn. I always have to earn more than that. So I strive harder. I work. I work very hard. So I get my slots fully booked. Okay. So basically, that's it. Not saying that if you want to, if you want, so if you want to earn more, just open more slots, right? And you just yes. work more. And and pay the right? Hindi siya wala siya cap. Is there a cap or something? 
Um, there's no that. limit. You can you can just a minimum of 55 peak slots for the whole cut off for maybe 15 days. And that's it. You can choose whether to open a schedule tonight or not. But at least you have to um, meet the standard of 55 open peak slots. Great. And, and, and I guess sobrang ganda rin. No? Kasi nga, you mentioned na uh, uh, you, kailangan mo lang ng 55 peak slots for per month, right? That's per month, right? That per, month? Uh, per, per cut off. Per cut off, yeah. So that's like yes. what, 15 days? 15 days, yes. One tenth, say somewhat. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so, uh, and if you don't feel like it, pe- uh, pwede kang hindi mag-open, right? As long as meron ka 55 peak slots, yes. right? Yes, So kung mag- magbabakasyon kayo ng family mo, you're going somewhere, pwede kang hindi muna mag-open and then bumawi ka na lang pagbalik, right? Mm, yes, yes, pwedeng ganun. And you can also bring your work with you. Like for me, I went to Davao and there is also a site in Davao. So I also get to earn while um, having fun with my family. Wow. Yes. <laughs> Gumala ako while earning sa also, Davao. Yeah. So, ang ganda nun. Like uh, guys, um, so... If you if you if you work at five one talk, it doesn't mean that you're not capable to move fast. You can work and, and you can you can go out and still earn, right? That because you're going to be very flexible. Yes, exactly. Awesome. So, so mga nag-uumpisa, nag-uumpisa palang. For example, ako ako kung mag-uumpisa, alright. Um, do you have any tips? Um, Ada or and Ingrid, so mga nagumpi sa palang. Ah, uh, okay. Yes. Um, if um if you're a newly launched teacher, um sometimes hindi pa masyado marami yung bookings mo, kasi nga it's like it's like an online um online selling. So if you don't have more mm. reviews, sometimes they're not going to trust you kasi nga wala pang masyadong review na maganda talaga, like trusted talaga na maganda yung lessons mo. So mm. yung tip ko dyan is if may mag-book sa you, give your like 500% give your best shot and um, make them make them come back to you again like um, tell them something to expect tomorrow like if you wanna if you wanna have more stars or more surprises tomorrow let's see you again tomorrow and you can um, can try to book more slots something like that and mm-hmm. yes uh, you just have to do something that makes them come back to you Yon. Tsaka ano din, no, um, Ada, I think it's also very important that they really take advantage of the trainings that are offered. Kasi with these trainings, of course, na equip ka. And correct me if I'm wrong, Ada, no, with each training then, parang with each lesson, of course, may mga, um, you have to get, uh, you have to familiarize yourself with the lesson, yung mga exercises. So, syempre, if you keep training then, tapos um, outside siguro of 5 one talk. Um, just read up more then, just so uh, mas marami ka rin nadadala pagka nagka-classic at iba. Yes, exactly. So you also have to be updated with the training kasi it boosts your profile. Um, students see that, oh, you're you're very good at grammar kasi nga you took this training and you passed this training so they're going to trust to have a lesson with you and that means earning on your end. Great, great tips, guys. Yeah, so again, uh, sa mga nanonood, uh, if, you're, if you are starting out, which is most likely yung mga uh, mag-a-apply pa lang, um, galingan nyo lang. I guess, yun yun, right? I mean, galingan mo lang kung makakuha ka. And actually, hindi na may sinasabi namin sa, sa mga nag-umbisa pa lang ng online jobs, ng home-based jobs, na wala pang kliyente. Kung nakakuha ka ng kliyente, ibigay mo muna lahat. Yes. Game, yeah, game mo lahat as in. As in, ay todo mo yan. Mm-hmm. Sagad mo. Kasi, um, kung hindi man mag-workout sa kliyente na yan, baka mag-leave sila ng review na maganda or mag-refer sila. Right? Yes, exactly. Mm-hmm. They they can also refer you. My my students are also, um, my regular students are classmates pala. 
So one of my students said, that, "Teacher, do you know Leo? Leo is my Leo is my classmate." So Leo's mom pala was referred by another student's mom. So magakilala lang pala sila. And I didn't recognize that until one time, um, Leo went to my students. Um, house to have fun and then while we were having classes I noticed someone na sa likod niya na naglalaro and teacher, teacher Leo! And then that's where I realized oh, magkakilala sila and ni-refer pala ni Leo ako sa isa sa isang student wow. and marami pang ganon they know it, some of my students some of my students know each other kasi nga nire-refer ka lang it's like you are um, you're very satisfied with this product so you refer it to your friends like hey try this out maganda siya or magaling siya uh-huh. And, 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 and ano yun eh, ah? ang referral is um, sobrang lakas ng marketing because they don't even think about it anymore. I mean, someone refers you something, lalo na kung kilala mo or you trust that, that person, you don't really, you don't even think about it, bibili mo yan or re-hire mo, right? So, so hmm. saga din nyo. And sabi nga ni Ingrid, like, magbasa kayo outside. Magbasa kayo, magbasa kayo ng, ano, ng stuff that will help you uh, grow, right? Because, yes. Uh, Teaching is teaching shouldn't shouldn't be stagnant, right? You need to you need mm-hmm. to learn then. Otherwise, well, wala ka naman matuturong bago if you don't learn, right? So correct. Oh, so I think uh, then, no, yeah. parang pag um, mas um of course you're more open to things. Mas marami kang alam, de ba? Parang conversation points ninyo na student. If you're trying to establish rapport, de ba? Imaginein mo na lang you're teaching a teenager, for example. Mm. Eh, parang ayaw mo mag-delve into sa world niya. So, parang, you know, it could be as simple as trying to find out ano ba yung mga pinakikinggan nila, ano yung mga pinapangit right, nila. Right. Yeah, I mean, like, uh, ano bang example, tinitiktok nila? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, exactly, right? Uh, for example, like, uh, teenager ka, uh, teenager yung kausap mo, I don't know, I don't know what, what teenagers are into nowadays, pero, I don't know, siguro anime, minanood pa rin anime na teenager, something like that. Something that might not be interested, say, uh, might not be interesting sa you, pero something that can be in a conversation opener, right? Or mm-hmm. an icebreaker, or a common ground, right? So again, ini yon extra effort, extra effort parin siya. So again, yun nga guys, um, uh, magbasa, mag-aral ng stuff na bago, kahit yung mga stuff na trending na wala kayong pakialam. <laughs> kasi, kasi right, di ba? I mean, kasi usually bata eh. And, and, and um, para maka, makita mo yung world nila, kailangan mong pumasok doon, right? So, so great tips, guys. Thank you. Okay, so now, um, punta natin yung mga questions. Yung mga questions. Um, ayan, sabi ni May, how long is the training daw? Um, the shortest training that we have in 5-1 Talk is a, an hour and 30 minutes. And then we also have upscale trainings that goes for three hours. Three hours or three to four hours. And the trainings are free. That's that's the best about 5-1 Talk. Everything is uh, free like the T-cell certification. If you don't mm-hmm. have a T-cell certificate, well, that's okay. If you have it already, that's very good. But... If not, and if you get in successfully as a teacher, 5-1 Talk will provide it for you for free. And if you get it for yourself, like you have to, you have to spend ten thousand or fifteen thousand if kukuha ka sa iba. So wow. sa five Talk free lang siya. So wow. amazing. I mean, I mean, yung yung palang is uh, pwede na maging ano? Eh, pwede na maging reason to apply. Eh. <laughs> yes. Yes. Training, training palang in the yeah, in the other training, of course, ang maganda rin dito, what I appreciate about 5-1 Talk is yung um, opportunity for the teachers also to level up. So it's not like they get into 5-1 Talk, tapos ganun na lang sila mm. forever. So there is, um, they can scale up sa platform. And of course, if they attend the training, they um, tumaas sila ng level, of course, nagkakaroon din ng increase dun sa incentives nila. Wow. So, yeah, so sobrang ganda nun. I mean, hindi siya parang... So I'm trying. To, I'm still trying to wrap my head around this platform, and in five. So once na na go na complete na training, I mean, nasa profile mo yon, right? Na like uh, si ganito, si Mark, complete this training. Parang ganon ba yon? 
Like, um, might hit sa profile or something? Yung or... nakikita sa profile mo is your rating or kung anong mm-hmm. klase teacher ka, master teacher ka ba. And then, um, the students also see how many students um, tap you as their favorite teacher. And, um, Meron din nakikita yung mga trainings na nakuha na mo na like the SK12 or yung mga upskill trainings because mm. 51 Talk is equipped with trainings from K from kindergarten to grade 12. So that's why we have um, basic K12 or um, up to senior K12. Okay, uh, may nakita akong tanong kanina or I don't know tanong yun or comment lang. Um, parang... Uh, teacher na siya sa labas, like DepEd certified, meron ba yung um, advantage? Like, if I'm a teacher outside and then nag-play ako dyan, nag-play ako sa 5-1 talk, will, will I have an advantage or or how does it work? Well, if they apply and they already have more, um, a lot of certificates like uh, from DepEd, um, sometimes they get a chance to have a, a promotion right away right away from getting launched like um instead of starting as a, as a starting teacher and newly launched mm-hmm. teacher um you're already a junior teacher or much better a senior teacher mm-hmm. oh great 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 well good good point yun sa nag nag comment kanina and do sa mga nanonood na uh teachers kasi meron ako meron kami mga ano rin mga teachers na uh DepEd certified na uh, certified na ano na mga tatay so uh, if you're on the fence pa, kasi hindi mo alam kung tutuloy mo yung sa... Pwede siyang, pwede siyang part-time, right? I mean, you, you mentioned earlier, pwede siyang part-time, right? Yes, pwede. Pwede, pwede. Kasi nga, 55 weeks last lang yung requirement if I want talk. So, if you work in the office from 8 to 5, well, you can open slots from 7 to 10. So, pwede, pwede. Very flexible. Sakto. So, kasi yun yung tinatanong din sa amin lagi. I mean, like, uh, sa, sa mga messages sa amin, and sa, you know, you know, il- ilang dang best ko na napasa na message na yan. Na, mer- na meron ba kayong part-time na work? So guys, ito na yung tanong nyo. Ito na yung sagot sa tanong nyo. Uh, so, mm-hmm. Sa five months, meron part-time na work. Okay? So, if you're into teaching, or yes. if you even have just an inclination to teach, right? Um, and you, of course, you pass the requirements. And you can apply, and you can do your part-time job sa five months. Right? Okay, um, sabi ni Alpon, uh, how many students can we cater in a day? Um, actually, it depends on you. If you open more than the required peak slots, uh, for me, I open 20, 20 slots every day. So I get to meet 20 different students every day also. Pero hindi yung, hindi yung, ano, hindi yung peak, right? Hindi yung, yung cap. Um, no, the the peak hours are just from 7 p.m. to 10 p.m. Six. So, I mean, hindi nyo, hindi nyo cap ng, ano, na... Um, we can have, um, as much as 36 classes every day. From 6 a.m. to 12 midnight. Okay, so, yun, yun. So, ganun karami, Al. Um, sabi ni Gregory Promotion, can you discuss more about that? Is that some kind of level up? Um, yes, promotion. If if you have or if you are um, above newly qualified teacher, every rating, iba-iba yung um, rate mo eh. For example, um, newly qualified guy, you have a different rating. If you are a master teacher, you also have a different rating. So that would be better if you have, um, it's a plus if you have certifications yeah, um, when you apply kasi you will jump sa senior or so junior teacher so that's a higher rank sa mga teachers okay um isang tanong na itim tanong nila pero ini rephrase ko na lang kasi wala nagtatanong nung gusto na itanong talaga um kasi you mentioned kailangan ng four year course right but what if let's say ako ako si Mark uh undergrad ako I'm lacking siguro in, in terms of units na lang kulang ako ng ilang units Pwede ko ba siyang like, can I uh, take some courses outside, some class outside para mapuno lang yung units? Or, or kailangan talagang graduate ako? Ang tanong ko is like, yung units lang ba yung basihan? Or yung 
actual na graduation. Ayun, does it make sense? Um, a diploma is actually required when you apply in 5-1 talk. So that means you need to complete all, all your units when you're still in college. So you need to have a diploma when you apply. Okay, so yeah, noted. So guys, again, uh, ulitin ko na para malinaw. So kailangan ni diploma. Yes. Right. Because uh, this is a requirement then. We're complying with, um, we're, uh, we're complying with the government. Of course, of course. Yeah. Chinese kasi, government. Kasi maraming, kasi may magtatanong nun eh. May you nasa know, Pilipinas tayo, right? And like, baka pwedeng, pwedeng palikuin parang ganun. So, <laughs> so kailangan diploma, okay? So, um, sabi ni Maria Elizabeth, no background to experience as a teacher, pwede mag-apply, pwede mag-apply, right? As long as you have, you know, you have the four-year course, uh you have the basic requirements ng, ng uh, hardware and meron kang at least three mbps na uh, uh, wired net right and pwede right uh sabi ni russell if we open slots may available students ba na kunin ng lahat ng slots na inopen natin or company ang magbibigay ng slots sa teacher uh no this is uh students right Students. Students, yes, students book, right? get to choose a teacher, yes. Okay. So, students yung magbibigay and mag, uh, uh, gagawa ng booking. Uh, siguro, uh, ang, ang pasunod na tanong na nito is how do, you, how do I make my profile more attractive para makakuha ko ng first student ko? Um, if you don't have a student yet and then you, you got launched already, well, that's an mm. um, opportunity to, for you to take advantage of the training because uh, um, it's visible on your profile to students. End. And yes, that's just basically it. You just have to attend trainings if there's no student yet. And if uh, you have a student already, um, they can start giving you reviews. The first review, that's the first... Um, yun ba parang proof na isa kang na okay ka magturo? Okay, so, uh, just to answer yung tanong, well, yung tanong, tanong ko yun. Um, pag wala pang students, what you can do, sabi nga ni Teacher Ada, is uh, get more training. Right? Get mm-hmm. more training. And lalabas yun sa profile. And it makes, it will make your profile more attractive to future students. Tama? Yes. Right. Great. Great. Well, mas maganda. I mean, like, medyo mas madaling gawin yun kaysa profile optimization. Right? Okay. You just have to go on training. May kita nila na nagkitraining ka. You're uh, competent, right? So, mas simple siya. Sabi ni Mace, for your course, dapat yes, Mace. Uh, sabi ni, Bas, ni Jean, good PM po. Ask ko lang, mahirap po, po ba talaga makapasa sa online teaching? Pag walang good environment, uh, yeah. Can you can you answer that? Please. Good environment, uh, I guess. Hindi siya ma- me- medyo maingay. Hindi maingay. Oh, oh. Yeah, yeah. Uh, that's very challenging. But um, if you really want to have this, um, if you really want it, well, you have to do everything to get it. So if if it's about the environment, the man, you can just have um, the lighting. For the lighting, you can place it behind your camera para maganda siya tingnan. Isang tip din yun sa mga tech, sa technical check. Kasi para walang shadow na nakikita dito or dito, mm. you can have the light behind the camera para sa iyo lahat naka-focus. And for the environment, well, um, maybe you can invest on a better headset para yung mga tilaok ng manok hindi marinig. <laughs> yeah. Yes, o yung mga noise kasi nakaka-distract siya eh pagka sa students, no, Ada? Yes, yes, exactly, ma'am. Yeah, totoo yun. Kasi last time I, I called into PayPal and I didn't, I didn't know yung PayPal is a Pilipino sim pala yung call center. So, tumawag ako, tapos may dumada ang tricycle. So, <laughs> para, sa skills ka rin pala. <laughs> Di ba? So, kala ko na sa US. Okay, so, yeah. So, sabi nga ni, ni Ada, um, mag-invest na lang if you really want it. Well, just tama naman talaga. I mean, if, if if you think that this is really for you, if you want to earn more, then spend a bit. Di ba? Di naman siya bank breaker. I mean, like, good headset, tama, for noise cancelling, right? 
And mm-hmm. yeah, yung background yun. May background ka na maganda and iilaw ka na nagaling na sada. Right? And it works naman eh. <laughs> diba? Um, sabi ni Joey, Teacher Juice, question, bakit ang ganda mo? <laughs> Nuts! Uh, <sabi> ni Gino, <laughs> Thank you! <laughs> sabi ni Ginule, my kids po kasi ako maingay. Uh, yun nga, noise cancel. Ako nasa studio ko ngayon kasi nasa Walang pasok, right? Tapos gabi. So, yung lahat ng anak ko nasa bahay. So, ang hirap mag-concentrate. <laughs> Nandiyan lahat yung bata. Tapos maingay. Um, headset brand recommendation po, sabi ni Russell. Um, for starting teachers, you can invest on Jabra. Very, very oh, Jabra, recommended yeah. yun. Yes, Jabra. Ang ganda ng quality. Kahit ang ingay ng paligid mo. And wala talagang marinig. Especially sa air class. If that's where we teach. Meron siyang, meron siyang system sa air class na additional noise canceling feature. So, mas walang maririnig. Yung bosses mo lang talaga. Okay. Me, do you, like, um, do you use a software or an app pa besides sa Jabra that cancels noise or? Some teachers, I guess, yeah. Parang, I know some teachers that they use um, another software for it. But for me, I only use Jabra and um, I just rely on Air Class. Kasi nga meron siya, noise cancelling feature din. Uh, okay, great. Uh, sabi niya isang, I don't know, but but wala siyang pangalan. Uh, sabi niya, new teacher here, if you want, five, one talk. So far, so good. I'm fully booked now. I was launched last March 20. That's uh, awesome, right? I mean, like... Congratulations! Ano, Nagbisa wow. lang siya last, uh, last month, uh, kasagsaga ng lockdown. And then, uh, I don't know, he or she, but uh, uh, she's earning. Diba? So, guys, yes. uh, tulad nga ni Facebook user, kung alam ba't wala siya pangalan, um, <laughs> na-launch lang siya last, last week ng last month and, and uh, fully booked na siya. So, uh, it can happen to you then, right? So, huwag kayong, I mean, don't, huwag nyo naman siyado pag-isipan pa. If you feel like it, if you feel na kahit hint lang na baka pwede ako dyan, go, right? I mean, like, there's no harm in trying, right? Yun yung problema kasi ng Pinay, nasyado in overthink lahat. Eh. Exactly. Apply. Pag, kung pasado ka naman sa requirements, apply and, and see if you're fit, di ba? Yes. Again, we are, uh, Five One Talk and Fish Dad and Fish Moms are collaborating para ibigay sa inyo itong opportunity na to. There's a link somewhere there dito sa, ayun o, dito sa plat, sa, sa uh, uh, platform. Uh, you can just click that and recta na yan sa application, application, uh, application portal, right? Yes, within 24 yes. to 48 hours lang, someone from Five One Talk will get in touch with them. Sabi ni Mark, hi Idol Mark, wala ba intermission number mo? Dami mo pala gitara. Props lang yan, Brad. Hindi ako marunong yan. <laughs> Tuturo, <laughs> Pero nasa uh, studio nasa, ka? Nasa studio ako. Nasa studio ng misis ko. So, uh, walang klase kasi nga, wala eh. I mean like pandemic, right? So, uh, kami rin, r- right now, nat- uh, we're teaching online na lang din. Pansamantala. So, yeah. And ginawang relief good center yung studio muna ngayon. So, yeah. So, 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 paring Mark, wala, walang intermission. Um, ay, Facebook user, si Melody Ferrer. For Melody. Okay, congrats, Melody. Hopefully, magtuloy-tuloy pa yan. Uh, sabi ni Russell, watching, sabi ni Russell, Jabra daw po ang brand na head. So, yan, sabi nga. So, uh, um, last two minutes, magtanong na kayo before we end this. Uh, it's been a very interesting uh, session. Thank you, ladies, actually. I mean, like, ako rin marami ako nakukunan. I've been hearing ESL for for as long as I remember. Di ko alam ibig sabihin. Nakiki-ESL lang din ako. <laughs> <laughs> so, yun pa na ibig sabihin nun. Um, Pero, Mark, thank you, ha. Thank yeah. you talaga for the opportunity. Yes. Oh, yeah, I mean, I mean, um, we, we can thank share you. this. I mean, like, uh, uh, um, our community, our community, especially in PH Dads, uh, we, I mean, uh, any tulong na mabibigay natin sa sa mga lalit sa mga tatay ngayon na, you know, na, na, na kailangan mag-transition. Hindi, na, hindi, hindi pwede, kailangan mag-transition. Kasi nga, hindi mo alam ano mangyayari after ng mm-hmm. 
April, right? I mean, like, sa US, i-extend pa nila eh. Uh, oh, sa Canada, oh. hanggang June na. So, I don't know. Hopefully, sa atin, tapos sa April pa, I doubt it. So, ngayon, I mean, mag-iisip ka na rin eh. I mean, yung mga maraming tatay na nag-iisip na rin na ano nga ba talaga yung after nito. So, this is sobrang laking opportunity, guys, na binigay ng 5-1 talk. Uh, grab it. Don't, huwag, huwag yun na masyadong pag-isipan. Don't be on the fence about it. Diba? Try your luck. And teach. Diba? Teach and learn money. Okay? Um, may tanong pa ba? Sabi ni Ricardo, pop tips for laying materials so we can use for a soundproof office. Soundproof. Soundproofing. I, uh, Adam, you know, may soundproof ba yung place mo or what? Um, wala, pero I know some teachers uh, who use egg trays para hindi sila marinig or hindi marinig yung nasa labas. I'm not so sure about that, but yeah, that's, that's I've seen it. Yeah. Mm. Um, uh, egg, yung egg trays is uh, para acoustic, acoustically treat yung room. Doesn't really soundproof. If you want to soundproof yung room, lahat ng nooks and crannies na pwedeng labasan ng hangin, kailangan nyo siya lagyan ng Walang naharang. Yeah. No foam. Yeah, foam. Um, that's basically it. If you want to acoustically treat your room, yung para maganda yung tunog, parang nasa studio ka, lagay niyo siya ng, ano, uh, yeah, yung egg trays or yung acoustic foam para yung kung sa kayo, ano, let's say ito, sa akin, puro, sa sige yung tura niyo. So, yan. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. So, taas rin. Yeah, so, yeah, so, Bigyan siya ng ganyan para maganda yung tunog. Uh, pero of course, kung nag-umbisa pa lang, doon lang sa, lagyan nyo lang ng harang muna lahat ng pwedeng lapasan ng tunog or pasukan ng tunog. That's, I think that's about it. Um, sabi ni Christian, to last question, sabi ni Christian, how do you get all the attention to a hyperactive kid online group? Um, you just have to blend in. If hyper sila, di mo paka hyper ka rin. Kasi nga, if you, if you just want to, uh, kung gusto nilang kontrolin sila, he, you cannot do that. Just for 25 minutes, that's impossible. So if they're hyper, well, if they want to dance, you also have to dance. Because you just have to assess their attitude. <laughs> oh, challenging. You have to blend in. Kailangan lumevel. <laughs> yes. Very yes. challenging yun. Uh, sabi ni Kendry, quick insight lang, baka may small click to ng teaching time. I don't think we can show that Kendry ngayon, pero you can follow Teacher Ada sa YouTube niya. YouTube niya. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. yeah. Also, um, um, 5 One Talk has a YouTube channel then sa YouTube, of course. <laughs> you can search there. Uh, I guess merong, merong dun samples or, or whatnot. So, um, ayun. Um, that's about it, guys. You need last question. Thank you again, ladies, for taking Thank the you. time and uh, making the interview, not really interview, the talk that much masaya. And I learned a lot of things, especially in the ESL yung 5 1 talk. Mismo. So, yes. Thank, thank you. you and um, again, yung link is nasa baba somewhere dyan. Nandun yung link. If wala, um, kupus namin yan in a bit. And there will be other contents pa because we are really trying to push this uh, to drive uh, our community to have um, well, a teaching, um, uh, what, what do you call this? Na magturo. And, and, yes. and kumitas magturo, basically. Magkaroon ng trabaho sa, sa, sa 5 one talk. Okay? Maraming salamat, guys. Have a great night. Thank you, Mark. Thank you very much. Saka thank you din dun sa ano ha, sa mga dads, saka moms. May you be encouraged um, to try out. And yun lang. Saka th- ano rin, thank you din and hello to all of the 5 One Talk teachers who have supported this live webinar. Yeah. Naka, naka ano ba sa kanila? Naka, naka, naka ano sa kanila? Naka share or something? Yes, naka share siya. Wow. So uh, nanonood sila sa mga groups. Kaya pala ang daming ano, ang daming teachers din. Awesome. Now, puli, magkano pa tayo ng siguro another round next time pag uh, marami ng applicants, marami ng nakapasok from uh, page dance and FH moms. Yun lang. Yes. Ay, maraming salamat, ladies. Thank you. And good Thank night. Thank you, everyone.
Good night. Thank you very much. Good night. Bye.